a lot of this boils down to the kosher organizations that restaurants and, and kosher establishments have to follow. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, like, for example, in New York, I'm throwing this out there and I might get a lot of hate mail for this, but in New York, <laughs> the mainstream Jewish Orthodox kosher organizations in restaurants, uh, unless you're under the OU, I guess, are very, very, very strict. And really? the way they kind of look at it is when in doubt, just say no. Mm. Um, I've, so I'm talking about bar consulting. So I've worked for uh, a number of restaurants and I've, I've had some run-ins with mashkichim who were just like, well, no, you can't use this. And I show them the product. I'm like, well, but look, the, the hashkacha is right there. Even uh, with the hashkacha no. on it? So I, with, a, with a hashkacha on the product, no. So I, I once asked, Why? What's the issue? And the response is, someone might say something. Someone might look at it and, eh. okay. So, you know, depending on where you are geographically in the country, <laughs> uh-huh. and um, I, maybe I'm, I'm starting like a political fire here, I apologize. <laughs> but I, I know, I, I just, I, that kind of thing just really like irks me. Like if, if something is kosher, then it's kosher. If it isn't kosher, then it isn't. I understand that there are different, levels and different preferences and humras and things like sure, hundred percent. But if the answer as to why you're saying no is because someone might say something about me or about my cash agency or whatever it is, like that's, that's I could I could see with maybe <laughs> they don't like, they don't agree with the particular, either in general, the Hashgacha, that particular certifying agency or maybe that particular certifying agency's policy on X, Y, or Z product, or the, the you know the processes involved. But right. wow, yeah. that's pretty yeah, wild. Listen, I, I thought you were yeah. going to say like, oh, it was like a I don't know something without a hashkacha, or even like a right. a, a fruit or, or vegetable product, but right. it was just it had a hashkacha already. What issues have you seen? Like, what when have they not allowed you stuff that was fine? Uh, two specific examples. <laughs> yeah. Um, I had an issue where a mashkech would not let me use Coco Lopez, uh, the cream of coconut. I wanted to make um, pina coladas and they yeah. would not let me use that product. Um, and also and, mint. And, and that's um, certified. Mint leaves. Wait, wait, wait. Coco Lopez, yes, yes, yes. Coco Lopez is, 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 has a hashkacha on it. Yeah. It's very prominently. <laughs> On it, and OU you uh, parv not good enough. Oh, you parv. Know, yeah, it's not OU even like parv, a dairy right? thing where you could say you know it's right. ha- not halvi. Oh, it's just... no. It's OU. No. Mm. OU you right there. That's right bonkers. No, nope, not good enough. Wow. Yeah. So and uh, then you were, and you were... mint. Mint also. Mint. Yeah. What were you saying? Yeah, mint. Mint. Mint leaves. What's wrong mint with leaves. mint? So I told him, okay, like, I'll wash them. Like, of course, I'm going to wash them. Like, I want to make sure that like, I'm not going to see any. It's like, no, no, you can't use mint leaves. So uh, in one restaurant, I could not use mint leaves at all. Uh, even if they were checked by the mashkiach, which I thought was insane. But we, listen. Why not? Um, <laughs> why not? And in another restaurant. Even I checked? I, I even checked by the mashkiach? Even checked, even checked by the mashkiach. And another, in another restaurant that I worked at, um, we were allowed to use mint, but only if it was checked by the mashkiach. The mashkiach had to go through the mint. It wasn't just like <laughs> wash it. Um, and I was like trying to explain how like small bugs don't like mint. Uh, mm-hmm. You might have an ant issue, but again, you wash those off. They're not going to stick to the leaves. Um, wow. Anyway, yeah. So wow. one restaurant, as long as it was checked by the mashkiach, would allow me to use mint. Another restaurant that I worked for, it didn't matter. Uh, whether or not it was checked didn't matter. You could mint not was use not mint allowed. Mint not allowed. Mint was not allowed. Yeah. Yep. Wow. 